All right, everyone, a bridge level. Uh, not level. World seven. It's called corrupt. So this will be interesting. What is corruptness? <laughs> okay, corrupt means that after you move with a corrupt thing, it will replace it with a wall. All right. There is a really sus shape that I'm almost making here. We're not going to do that. <laughs> Okay, but we have, like, we need to push, right? We absolutely need to make a push at the very end. Otherwise, we don't have enough uh, entrances to get in there. Alright, level 3. So, yeah, I, I believe multi-pushing is going to be key to this. Key to not dying. Oh, wait. No! How's that going to come in? Okay, I think we accidentally, like, succeeded. There we go. Oh, this is such a different way to think about it. Ah, uh, okay. Diagonal here. Hmm. Okay, we'll just use the diagonal to assist, I guess? Well, we're really, like, more babying the diagonal around. I can even go, like, here. Oh. Well, that, that was sure a lot of level that wasn't used. <laughs> Alright. 55. What now? It's called Spiral. And obviously... Like... Okay, but they're all, like, on the same parody? What's going on here? How are we gonna fix this? Hmm... Let me just switch the parity one more time. They're all the same parity. We'd like to fix them efficiently. But it's not so easy. Now I can't like... Well, I can do that. I think this might work actually. There we go. Easier than I thought it would be. Level six. Oh my gosh, how? Is this gonna be hard? There's so much blank space. I I am going to think this is difficult. No it isn't! Alright. Okay, level seven. We have non-corrupt pieces now. Pretend pieces. Okay, but how are we going to do this, though? Well, okay, if I do that, because it's not a corrupt piece, it doesn't matter. Alright. Well, first of all, let's not get that one stuck, but everything else should be fine. However, I'm really going to prioritize trying to make moves that, like... Uh-oh. Well, that sucks. <laughs> that, that don't, like, create corrupt walls behind. That would be good, I think. Just as a general idea. Still, this still does not seem easy to do. And I don't want to make corrupt walls just yet. But, like, I, I almost thought I saw something, but it wasn't working. <laughs> Let's just reset and see if there's anything to do here. So the best way for me to make, uh, make good moves here is pulling these out. Obviously. and But then the blue comes in and fixes things. Like that. Yes, okay. Well, we, we still have yet to see where this if this is going to work well for the ones on the right side, but obviously fixing everything on the left is really good. Well, we just transported everything to the... Do I need to do any moves with the corrupt pieces? Oh, give me an achievement for this. I can win the level without doing that, right? Just want to be a, a massive gimmick maker. There we go. No corruption at all. Alright, it's level 8. Hmm. We need to fix parity. 
think I should do that as the first move. Okay, there we go. Level 9. Let's go. Scattered. Well, we have a bunch of ways to get into the end. Everything is corrupt, however, and the key thing will be getting this fixed. It already seems like it's on kind of good parity to do so. I don't know. Well, it's not really on great parity to do so. We push this out in here. Okay. I guess we can. Is there any reason this should be difficult? What? The answer is no. It is it's, it's no. Anyway, 10. The number 10 finally justifies the extra zero on the map. Um, I don't know if it bothers anyone else when they add extra zeros that are useless. And they're still kind of useless, but come on. I don't want to see that crap. It's a meme anyway. Okay, so. Am I missing something with this? I, mean, I could always just pull that back out if I need to. Okay. This might this might be one of those situations where I do need to use a corrupt move. I, I don't know. Well, I can load this in, in here and not spend a corrupt move. Is the cycling around the meme of this thing? Oh wait, we do we don't cycle you fool. Just prepare this. Okay. I don't like that it pulled that. I don't know. Okay. And... Can I just win from here, or is there more that I need to do? Um... Yeah, I know I'm probably being more worried than I should be here. That I'm not going to have a way to get rid of that. Because this will create a wall behind, obviously. Hmm. Not as easy or obvious as it appears. Okay, I'd like that blue to not be on this side. I don't know if it's possible, though. Let's get out of the way. This seems terrible. This really does. I don't know how to fix that. This seems so almost good, right? I think that's good. Just undo that. Hmm. I can flip it around. <clears throat> that doesn't look good at all. It really does seem like I need both red and blue to be on the opposite sides here. I wanted to, like, try to get blue on the other side here. I'm not even sure it's a good idea, or would it even working, but... I wanted it so that this is pushing the blue into position. Wait, no, no, we don't need any of that crap, because it's working. It's working! Alright. Screw that pushing blue idea. There we go. Can't- Oh, gosh. Why is it such a mess? <laughs> uh, alright. Like, we have a- we have a normal pusher and puller. I think this is intended to actually be easy despite looking like a mess. Alright. Did I really mess it up? Hold on. Alright. Looks like we did it. There we go. There's a menu. I can't wait to see what they do for the next world. Um, as they already combined all the stuff in Corrupt, right? So, let's 
see a teaser of World 8 mirrored. Alright, see ya.